Did you know that the worst terror attack on American soil prior to 9-11 took place in the heart of New York's financial district in 1920? Picture this, Wall Street in the Roaring Twenties, a bustling hub of commerce and trade. The streets are crowded with workers taking a break from the hustle and bustle of their daily grind. A horse-drawn carriage trundles along, seemingly no different from any other vehicle on the road, but as the carriage halts outside the US Assay office, directly across from the JP Morgan and Company building, the driver mysteriously vanishes. This ordinary scene takes a sinister turn when the seemingly innocuous wagon, laden with dynamite, explodes in a devastating blast. Shrapnel flies everywhere, turning a typical midday scene into a horrifying tableau of chaos and destruction. In a matter of seconds, Wall Street's daily bustle turned into a scene of chaos and destruction. The explosion was devastating, killing at least 38 people and seriously injuring 143 more. The immediate aftermath was a scene of utter destruction, with debris and smoke clouding the air. The once bustling financial district was transformed into a ghost town, the silence only broken by the echoes of sirens and cries of the injured. The impact was not only physical but also psychological as fear and confusion gripped the city. The explosion had caused significant damage to the surrounding buildings, including the US Assay Office and the JP Morgan and Company building, symbols of American finance and stability. Emergency response teams were on the scene within minutes, working tirelessly to rescue survivors from the rubble and provide medical aid. The city's hospitals were overwhelmed with the victims of the attack, their injuries ranging from minor cuts and bruises to life-threatening trauma. In the blink of an eye, Wall Street had become a war zone. Authorities were quick to investigate, but the case proved to be far from simple. The Wall Street attack of 1920 presented a labyrinth of unanswered questions and elusive leads. As the dust and confusion settled, the investigators found themselves standing on the precipice of a mystery that seemed to deepen with every step they took. In the wake of the tragedy, a multitude of theories cropped up like wildflowers amongst the ruins. Some pointed fingers towards anarchist groups drawn by the symbolism of attacking the financial heart of the nation. Others suspected foreign enemies, while a few even ventured to suggest it was an inside job, a plot hatched within the very walls of Wall Street itself. Yet, Despite the swirling vortex of suspicion and conjecture, no individual or group ever stepped forward to claim responsibility. An eerie silence hung over the investigation, as if the culprits had vanished into thin air, leaving only destruction in their wake. Investigators worked tirelessly sifting through the wreckage, interviewing witnesses, and following every lead, no matter how faint. Still, the case remained stubbornly unsolved. As the months turned into years and years into decades, the Wall Street attack of 1920 slipped from an active investigation into the annals of unsolved mysteries. Despite the best efforts of investigators, the Wall Street attack of 1920 remains one of America's most infamous unsolved cases. It's a chilling reminder that even in the heart of the world's most powerful nation, some secrets remain locked away, haunting us with their silence. And nearly a century later, the Wall Street attack of 1920 remains a stark reminder of the threat of domestic terrorism. This event, often overshadowed by more recent attacks, nonetheless has left an indelible mark on the American psyche and the nation's approach to security. A horse-drawn carriage laden with dynamite detonated in the heart of the financial district sent shockwaves through the country, both literally and figuratively. The death and destruction that day highlighted the vulnerability of even the most secure locations. In the wake of the attack, a significant shift in America's security measures began to take shape. It was a wake-up call, a grim indication that the threat of terrorism wasn't just an overseas issue, but could strike at home in the heart of the nation's largest city. There was a new realization that the safety of the American people was not guaranteed, even within their own borders. This realization led to increased security measures, not just on Wall Street, but nationwide. The attack served as a catalyst for the creation of more robust law enforcement agencies and a more proactive approach to potential threats. It influenced how the country responds to threats of terrorism, shifting the focus from reaction to prevention. 
Though unsolved, the Wall Street attack of 1920 forever changed the face of American security and the heart of its financial district. It taught us that vigilance is not just a virtue, but a necessity in the face of an ever-evolving threat landscape.